What's going on, Park Hoppin? This is Jay and story time. Story time. I told this story on a live stream how me, I got to hang out with Josh DeMauro. Um, yeah, the president of Walt Disney World here in Orlando. That's right. I got to hang out with this guy, with Josh, my good friend Josh. I told this story on a live stream and uh, people got a kick out of it. So I just figured I'd put it on a video here for, for your entertainment because it's, it's entertaining. It all started with the Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway. It was the premiere of their brand new ride in Hollywood Studios. It replaced the great movie ride. Uh, just to give you some reference, if you've never been there, when I got there, let's see, the line was about three and a half hours long. It started outside, but I was there. I was determined. I didn't care how long I had to wait. I wanted to get some video on the channel of this new ride and, and the experience of being there for a premiere. So waited and waited and waited. Once we finally got inside, I was with some friends. Um, I just I didn't notice the whole time, but there was a guy, a cast member. His name was he had a name Josh on on his pin, on his cast member pin. He was wearing a blazer. He was wearing a blazer, and he was he was like right next to me. He was right next to me, and I kept looking over, and I was like, I know this guy from somewhere. I know this guy from somewhere. I think he helped me one time. I think he helped me. Maybe I should thank him. So I was like, Excuse me, Josh. You know, like he was my good friend. I was like, hey, Josh. Hey, Josh. And he looked over. He's like, hey, how can I help you? Very kind. Very nice. And I said, I know you from somewhere. I said, did you help me out with something? Uh, did you help me out with, with something? Uh, I know you probably don't remember me, but I, I know you from here. He goes, listen, I'm just a cast member. That's it. That's what he told me. He's like, I'm just a cast member. And you would think someone that uh, is part of a theme park channel would know who that person is. And so we were in line together, and he was talking to his friends, talking to mine, and then also we kind of talked with each other. We were just going back and forth, talking like the park. Yeah, I wish Galaxy's Edge, you know, had some original trilogy stuff. Oh yes, well that's cool. Okay, I'll be. I'm gonna talk to my. Okay, I talked to my friends. I'm back. Yeah, what did you think? Oh yeah, this is cool. I, I'm enjoying this, you know. Uh, and we're back and forth, just just casual, casual talk. And I thought nothing of it. And the only evidence I have, because you might say, that's impossible. He would never wait in line uh, with the common folk. He wouldn't do that. Like This is the only evidence I have. I was taking pictures of the line. And you could see Josh here in the corner. <laughs> I swear. I swear I had evidence on my phone when I was filming. But it was like, it just was a crowded people. You know, crowded people in line. I didn't want to keep it on my phone. Because my phone is like is already like jam packed with stuff already, and I deleted it. And and uh, I know he was in that video. And yeah, go ahead, go ahead, call me call me names because the hamster wasn't spinning, and and I totally get that. So we get up to the ride, and my my friends get in in the car, and we get in, and he's actually behind us, uh, riding, and here I'm filming. Filming everything, this and that, filming the ride, having a merry old time, uh, get off the ride, you know, everything's cool. Did you enjoy the ride, sir? Yeah, I thought it was cool. I, I really enjoyed that. Um, yeah, it was nice meeting you, too. Yeah, nice meeting you. All right. Thank you. Have a great, have a magical day, right? Have a magical day. I didn't think anything of it. I, I, I me and my friends went out and had a, you know, had a, had a regular day in Hollywood Studios, hung out, got some food, did some things. I actually wrote uh, Rise of the Resistance that same day. Um, yeah. And um, so <laughs> I didn't think anything of it until, until. Now, now, for reference, I was sending some of these pictures to the Park Hoppin' team, and they didn't recognize them either. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I'm not the only one. We went to the Magic Kingdom on the last day before they were closed for this quarantine and I wanted to see the Magic Kingdom fireworks one last time. I wanted to go to the Magic Kingdom uh, one last time. I didn't know how long things would be closed, you know. So we were like, let's just go. Um, the Magic Kingdom was pretty empty that day. It was I, it was the only time I've ever been in the Magic Kingdom where I rode every single ride. And I could have ridden every single ride I wanted to ride. Except for some of like the teacups. I don't want to get sick. But Peter Pan to Space Man. I rode every single ride that I wanted to do. And I could have ridden more. Um, until the fireworks, and it just seemed like all the cast members from everywhere that even weren't working were there. 
Um, you could see a lot of people holding hands and singing, a lot of people crying. You see their cast member badges everywhere. It was like they all just said, this is it. This is the last time uh, we're going to come back and enjoy this. So on the way out, I saw Josh. And he had a big, the big Mickey gloves on, you know. Uh, and he's like shaking people's hands, saying goodbye, and, and people are crying. He just had a crowd around him. And I'm like, who the heck is this guy? So I snapped this picture. I sent it to my team. I said, this guy's important. Uh, can you tell me who he is? Like, who, who is this person? And they text me back. They're like, oh my gosh, that's the president. That is the president of Walt Disney World. And I was like, you've got to be kidding me. You've got to be kidding me. You mean this whole, t when, when I was there at Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway, I could have had, I could have had an interview. I could have got some selfies. You know, I could have like talked his head up. I could have introduced myself. I could have said, I could have done all these things. I'm very extroverted. I have no problem, you know, talking. I could have said all these things to him, but no, 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 no. I wanted to tell him how bad Galaxy says was. <laughs> they didn't have original trilogy characters. So I went up to him while we were all leaving. I was like, hey, Josh, you remember me from Mickey? My, he's like, have a magical day. <laughs> That's all he said. Yeah, there he was crowded. Uh, he was crowded. And I was like, I'm with my friends, we're walking out, and I told them who he was, and they remembered, because they were with me, they were with me, and they just started laughing, they were laughing at me, they were like, you mean this whole time, you were like snapping at him and saying, hey Josh, how's it going, like yelling like he's your friend, and that's the president of Walt Disney World, I was like, pretty much, uh, pretty much, pretty much, so Josh, if you're watching, uh, Mr. President, I would really love to get that selfie. I'd really love to get that, uh, you know, five-question interview. And also, I would really like to thank you for um, being being uh, uh, kind and, and uh, courteous and patient with people like me. People that are just yelling your name out in the middle of a line. People that are, <laughs> are, just, are just acting a fool um, when they don't know who you were and or who you are and and stuff so i apologize so josh if you ever see this uh i would just i would love to uh shake your hand say thank you and get that photo and uh because i think that'd be pretty cool anyway that's the video <laughs> hope you enjoyed it hope you enjoyed it and uh this is jay with park hopping i'll catch you next time Hey everyone, it's Jeremy from GeeksAndGamers.com, and if you're a fan of Geeks and Gamers, please go to our website, visit our merchandise store. We have t-shirts, hoodies, hats, beanies, tank tops, and in the very near future, we're going to have many more products for you to choose from. So thank you for the support. We appreciate it. You guys have a great day, and we will talk to you later.